Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another freaking Transformer review. Because I love some freaking Transformers. Why not? This is Omega Supreme from New Age. This is the end of the road, or this is the battle damage. It's a huge box. Look, I love the artwork, the Omega. And you got, uh, looks like probably Nemesis Prime and Bumblebee. You got Grimlock right there for end of the road. Really nicely done. War Machine, Michaels, what they call him. Future belongs to the Mad. That is really cool. There you go. End of the row. Kind of a Mad Max thing going on. And then on this side, you got Omega right there. War, War Machine. Michael. And then end of the row right here. Once again, enough for a beautiful picture. My box was kind of damaged, but nothing wrong with the figure. And there on the other side, same thing. All right. Underneath. There you go. All right. Let's take a quick look at what he comes with. All right, well, the only thing he comes with is instructions, and he comes with a little blue um, little screwdriver uh, to, you know, change out the batteries because it does have um, electronics. Unfortunately, I do not have any batteries left for this one. So, uh, but here are some ones it takes. It's this 27A. Uh, they look like these right here. This one does not work. I tried it, and it's dead. Uh, but it's this little lithium A27, 27A, 12 volt. It's one of these little batteries. You can get them off uh, Amazon. I think for this, uh, like a five pack was like maybe t less than $10. I don't even remember. Um, but yeah, that's what kind of battery it takes. And you would put it, you would, you know, take the little screwdriver or whatever screwdriver you have and unscrew it right there and put it in there. Like I said, I tried that battery and it did, it was dead. So not able to use the electronics on this one. So it's all right. Um, I've used them on the other ones, but there he is in his alt mode, you know, the base mode and it looks freaking spectacular. I love all the dry brushing, the dirty grit. It just feels dirty on your, in your hands. It feels awesome. But yeah, you got all this, you know, dirty grit and everything, all this, you know, like I said, you know, battle damaged and everything. So it looks good. So here you go. I'll just, we'll take a quick look at the uh, tank. And once again, beautifully well done with the paint and the dry brushing and the, you know, it looks, just looks bright. It looks like, you know, Omega has been through some stuff and everything. So now this does go all the way around 360. It doesn't go, it didn't, you know, you know, move up or anything like that. Kind of wish it did, but you can move the turret a little bit, everything. And then you would turn on the electronics right here and it would, you know, start moving. It, has, it does roll and everything. And these little things would go in between there and it would run the track. Uh, but unfortunately it does not work right now. But anyways, there you go. Nice. And just looks beautiful. I love it. All right. We'll take a quick look at the rocket too as well. Once again, well done. Got a bunch of dry brushing dirt grindy feel to it there you go these do move you can have them kind of sitting up like that it will hold itself up i think will it maybe not all right well it's a little too heavy but there you go so there is the track and um i'll do a little you know i'll take the camera and go around and you can see a little bit but there you go there is omega in his alt mode i think it looks freaking awesome all right, so real quickly, there is some, you know, legend scale stuff. Um, I think maybe, you know, Dr. Woo 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 stuff kind of works if you squint your eye and tilt a little bit. I think nothing really, you know, really scales well with the base mode. But you got New Age, you got Megatron and Optimus Prime and Mirage. Uh, I threw in Magic Square um, a Mirage over there. You got one of the Iron Factory Seekers. You got, you know, this is a... Know, prime mold right here as well then you got you know dr Wu, you got hauler you got perceptor and you got uh, cosmos over there and you got ultra magnus um then you got a little uh you know core class wheelie and then i threw in tis mcgee retgar over here and then you got the uh mirage right here so you know nothing really scales well with it maybe dr Wu a little bit but still a little too big for it, everything so but there you go there's some scale for you
Before we move on, I had the feet wrong. So right here, you know, you have this little gap. Now it does make him taller. You can leave it however you want to, but uh, there's not supposed to be a gap right here. It's supposed to be like this. Uh, I forgot to uh, close them down, so I'll fix that real quick. But like I said, it does make them a little taller. If you want to uh, do that, you have, you know, if you're transforming, do whatever you want to. But like I said, I had that wrong. I apologize. It's supposed to be like this. All right, back to transformation and fixing the legs. Here he is. I have the visor up because it is a pain in the butt to get out of there. But you can see the nice orange paint, the beautiful metallic blue eyes. Once again, you got some bow damage. Bow damage to the out looks beautiful. I know I'm going to say it a lot, but man, the scratch marks look really good. I like that translucent red right there. He does, I'll close this right here real quick. Uh, he does have the uh, missile boobies right there and they look good. They're nicely painted. A little red and everything. Got the nice translucent red right there. Paint job is beautiful. All right, as far as articulation, so you can lift up the neck really high. You can look up really nice. Uh, down a little bit as well. Side to side, no attitude or anything like that. You can, uh, it comes flat down, so but you have, you can lift up the neck so it gives you more articulation, but you can have it down if you want to, but kind of loses that, so that's nice. All right, so like I said, um, with the arms, you can flip these up if you want. Uh, these go all the way out to there and goes up to there. You got a nice ratchet like that. Uh, it does go all the way, but you know, it does get stuck right there, but you can move this out of the way and get the full 360 if you want. Uh, you do have a nice elbow bend. Now, once you start doing this, it will get a little loosey-goosey right here. Just be wary of that. You do have a bicep swivel, and then that's about it for that. Once again, that is beautifully well painted. Now, with the uh, claw arm, same uh, articulation. Uh, with this, you got all the way out to there. You got one uh, hinge, and you got another hinge right there, and this will spin too as well. So very nice. All right, move those out of the way. Nice ratchets. You do have a waist swivel. There's a little squeaky weaky, little fans toy squeak. You do have a nice ratcheted ab crunch and you can look up so it doesn't defeat the purpose. I like that a lot. All right, nice ratchet for the legs. Band down all day, every day. Very nice. All right, now you kick up to about right there, but it does have a drop down like that. So you can get some more up, so that's good and back as well. And you do got thigh swivel, move that back up. Thigh swivel, knee bend, nice ratcheted. It is ugly, but you get the full effect. I like that, very nice. Now with the uh, feet, you can get a toe tail up, just a toe, and you got a nice rocker. Uh, nothing down or anything like that. And that is about it. Cleans up pretty good. Got a little backpack, but you know, it's the rocket and all that stuff and the you know tracks and everything. Here's the back. Put that together back in beautifully well painted as always looks great all right there you go there's omega all right real quick here's a little comparison the only two i have out right now the other ones are put up but uh, that's the original one that's the tune deco and you got the clear version as well and just little comparisons with that so yeah it looks freaking awesome and there he is next to the devastator from you know new age that uh, that is also the end of the road or battle damage one and then you got king's toys predator king as well so a little scale reference for there. So he is taller than both of them. So yeah, awesome. And there he is next to New Age Optimus Prime, Megatron, Mirage. You got Bumblebee and then Grimlock uh, from the Dinobots. And there's Dr. Woo Woo Woo. You got Ultra Magnus, Cosmos, Ramjet, and Perceptor. And there's Magic Square, Ultra Magnus, Mirage, Core Class Wheelie, and then Tits McGee, Redgar. And that's some scale for you. And then Crappy Gunnets, Crappy Toilet Paper, AAA Battery, Carmex, K-Bears, Kicker, and Squeaks more scale. Well, hey there, everybody. If you have made this far, as always, I appreciate that. All right, final thoughts on New Age. This is Michael, or uh, Omega Supreme, everybody knows. This is the end of the road, battle damage version. I love this mold. This is my fifth one. I didn't get the uh, toy version or the shattered glass version, but I think I'm going to go back and try to find those. If I can get a good deal, I may get one or get them both and uh, finish it off. So really love this one. The paint job is spectacular. My God, they really do a great job. On the Battle Damage one, they did with Devastator, Grimlock, Starscream. I still need to get Optimus Prime and Megatron. If I can find those, I'll get those too as well. Because, man, love it. Love the articulation, the sculpt, the, the materials. Just great. I love it. I highly recommend If you get one, definitely get Omega. Get the whichever one, man. They're all great. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, hit me up with some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. Hit me up some comments what you thought about this guy. What do y'all think about the paint job? It's freaking awesome. Uh, go to show Z, go up there at the top, hit deluxe 32 up there. That's your favorite uh, YouTuber. 
It really helps uh, support the channel and also shows that shows that I sent you and everything. So definitely go do that for me. And, you know, if you can't find all Omega, buy something else, man. They got tons of stuff to buy from. So definitely go check out some shows Z store. And I uh, guess I'll see you in the next Transformer review. And as always, be good to yourself. Man, hell freaking Transformers and hell freaking New Age, man. Love me some Legends. Legends is life, man. Love it. Um, also, follow me on TikTok and on Instagram. All that wonderful stuff. It's all in the description. Really helps out the channel. Go watch my reviews. That really helps us too. And uh, let's just crush this freaking baby. <sighs> yeah. Oh, man, that's a frame. Look at that. So freaking beautiful. Love it. Good night, folks.